There are plenty of times when keeping your driver on the road calls for a little bit more elbow grease than your elbow might have. And that's when you want to rely on an impact wrench. So in this case, I can connect this to an airline, which of course goes back to an air compressor, and I can use this to get a lot more torque than my arm can provide and crack those nuts and bolts loose. Now, of course, this relies on that air compressor being present in order to run. So I want to talk to you about some other options that you have for impact wrenches. So one way you could go in the absence of an air compressor would be with an electric impact wrench like this one. So I still have a tether, I've got to tie this into a wall. Electric impact wrenches like this are capable of somewhere in the range of 350 foot-pounds, maybe a little bit more, maybe a little bit less, depending on what you buy, how much you spend. Now with this, I don't have to have the support system, I don't have to make the investment in the compressor and the airline to drive it, but like I said, I do still have to rely on having 110 volts available in order to drive it. What I really want to show you is this cool little baby. This is a cordless impact wrench. With this one, I've got a lithium battery on here. It's capable of 450 foot-pounds of torque. Now that's going to change depending on which model cordless you buy, but again, a range from 300 to 450 foot-pounds is available. What's pretty cool about this is that here in the shop, I don't have to worry about owning an air compressor. I'm not tethered with an airline to the air compressor. If I ever get into a scenario where I want to go into a boneyard and pick parts off a vehicle there, I can take this along. And again, don't have to worry about having an air compressor with me. Somebody breaks down on the side of the road and you want to go out there in the rain and help them change that tire, you can take this along and pull the lugs right off of those studs, no problem. So it does have a lot of advantages. One of the things you'll notice is that it does also have a lot of size to it. So every once in a while, you run into a scenario where because of its bulk, you just can't fit it into the space that might otherwise accept a wrench like this. But if you're in the market for an impact wrench and you're just early in the game, in other words, you haven't already made the investment in a compressor in an airline, a battery-driven impact wrench like this is a good thing to consider, and it might be something that fits real well into your shop and the repair work that you do.